Hey guys, we're Jack and I'm back with another video. And today, if y'all cannot tell from the title of the video, we are here with my Christmas Day vlog. So with that being said, let's get started with today's video. So right now it is December 24th, 2023, Christmas Eve. And the time is around 7 p.m., maybe 8 p.m.-ish. And basically today, in my previous video, if you haven't checked it out, you can check that out right here. But basically in that video, I mentioned that my Christmas Eve was basically consumed by work. So yeah, I basically worked all day. I went into work at 10. We left at around six. After that, I went to go to Target to do last second, like getting stuff. Um, basically, I just got some gifts from my cousins and then some breakfast stuff so I can cook breakfast for my parents tomorrow morning. And right now the time is like eight. I just been chilling in bed. Like I just been like, you know, chilling in bed. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, don't mind my clothes. I've been watching YouTube. Um, yeah, I've been chilling because I am tired. But with that said, in today's video, it is going to just be a vlog and mainly the beginnings of my Christmas morning tomorrow. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that. So basically, I guess what I'm trying to say is that in this video, you're just seeing me wrapping presents, um, opening my presents for my sister, um, and I guess just talking, um, and yeah, just going from there. But with that said though, real quick, I'm going to take a quick nap because I am tired, but I wanted to start the video. So yeah, I'm gonna take a quick nap and I'll see y'all when I wake up because I'm tired. Just kidding, before we go, you know what I'm saying? I got the Tyler Algier shirt on. Don't know how well y'all can see it, but you know, we got the Tyler Algier shirt. And I just wanted to talk because it's like, yes, the Falcons won, the Falcons beat the Indianapolis Colts. We won like 29 to 10, but we won, but we still lost, if that makes sense. I, I feel like I could speak for all Falcons fans and all Falcons fans really want Arthur Smith gone. And basically, if we lost, Arthur Smith would have been fired. Um, but yeah, so we won. We're still in the playoff race, but I feel like we're going to lose the next two games. And with that said, we lose. We're not going to make the playoffs. And basically, we're not in the playoffs. We're going to get like a mid-pick. We're going to get like a mid-round pick, which is basically like from pick 10 to maybe even like the 20s. And that doesn't help us out because, you know, we need a good pick. So it's like I'd rather have lost and fired Arthur Smith and just started anew. Um, but it is what it is. The Falcons won, so we better make the fucking playoffs somehow. I don't think we are. Our season's over. But it is what it is, so... Yeah, at least we got to see Cal Pitts score a touchdown. With that said, I did put some money on prize picks. And honestly, prize pick is not for me, because I always lose. And people always say I got a gambling addiction. No, I don't. I don't have a gambling addiction, because I could stop prize picks. And I could delete prize picks so easily. Because it's like, it's not fun. I don't fucking win, so why am I going to keep that stupid ass app? Because I always fucking lose. But if they sponsor me, though, I'll continue to play. But, yeah, I don't know. That's just my little rant about prize pick. Maybe one day I'll make a full video on that, but we'll see. But, yeah, with that said, the Falcons won, but we lost because, yeah, we won the game. We're, what, like 7-8? But that doesn't fucking matter because next week we play the Bears, then we play the Saints. We finish the season, what, 9-8? and You know what I'm saying? We're still not going to make the playoffs, I bet. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah, we need the Bucks to lose. The Bucks won today. So it's like, yeah. It is what it is, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, we our season's probably over, and we're probably going to get a bad draft pick, and we're probably going to keep Arthur Smith, and, yeah, we're probably just going to be trashed for a couple years. So, being a Falcons fan is hard. I'm sad, and, yeah, I'm a depressed Falcons fan. But with that said, though, like I said, I'm going to take a quick nap because your boy is tired. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to go from there, take a quick nap, and go from there because I need to stay up later tonight to wrap gifts and, you know, make my parents... Christmas gift. That'll make more sense later because I have to build them. Um, so yeah, I have to stay up and do that. But yeah, other than that, um, yeah, I'm gonna take a quick nap because I am tired. All right. So the time is about like 10:30 ish, and I just woke up from a nap. I'm tired. My mom came in, was talking shit. She was like, "Your room's messy. Whose gifts are these?" Being just nosy as fuck. Um, but yeah, I am awake from my nap and yeah i don't know what i'm gonna do next i think now probably gonna shower and then i'm gonna tackle the pile of clothes right there but yeah definitely gotta shower real quick so i'll yeah bam i just got out the shower and yeah the time is almost 11 to be honest i don't know what i'm gonna do first i'm definitely gonna tackle the laundry first um i'm gonna go from there um yeah that's just the uh, update on where I'm at and yeah I'm gonna check back in whenever I can or whenever I do something because yeah right now 
I'm just chilling. With that said, though, I got me some collectible cards. I got me a football one and a baseball one. And when it comes to baseball, I just try to look for Braves players or Shohan Atani. When it comes to the football ones, I try to get the Falcons one. But basically, yeah, these are what I've been really into lately. So we are going to just open this on camera because why not? This video is probably going to be long as fuck anyway. So, you know, we're going to have fun with it. So, yeah, let's try to open this with one hand. <clears throat> okay, wait. wait I'm gonna, I'll, I'll be right back. All right, so we got the cards out. We got Bollywood Jr. We got Daniel. I don't know how to say his last name. Real Rudy. Austin Wells. Who's this? Jonathan. I don't know how to say his name. Whitney Hedgehog. Who's this? Who's this? Freddie Feeney. Tanner. I don't know. Y'all might be roasting, but I don't know that much about baseball. Who's this? Don't know who that is. Bob Lemon. Don't know who that is. Who's this? Who's this one? Owen oh, Murray. I don't know how that is. Who's this? I don't know who half these players are, I ain't gonna lie to you. Maybe I shouldn't have buttons, but I don't know. Yeah, Jacob Bremer, don't know who that is. Who's this? Drew Gilbert. Frank Thomas. And last but not least, Jeff Bagwell. Don't know who that is. So for the NFL one, we got first things first, Tyler Algier, who had a big game today. So football, I definitely know more of. Who's this? Hayden Hurst. Um, I hope Hayden Hurst feels better after his brain injury that he had recently. And then Amash Ra St. Brown. Who's this? I don't know who this guy is. We got, who's this? The Unicorn Cow Pitts. We got Donovan People Jones. Uh, Andre Reed. We got Zay Jones. This is kind of hard doing it with like one hand, but you know. Next, we got, oh God. We got Josh Allen, Sam Ellinger, the Forrest Buckner. Who's this? This is Jerry Huge. Who's this? Dutton Schultz. Oh, who's that? Um, I don't know who this guy is. Derek Carr, shout out to Derek Carr. I can continue being ads on the Saints. I don't know who that guy is. Who's this? Who's this? Uh, I don't know who that guy is. Is this Scary Terry? No, that's Carter Samuel. Is this D-Hop? Well, no, that's Kevin Byron. Who's this? Oh, the tight end, I don't know how to his name. Levante David. We got a CJ Stroud college looking one. It's kind of cool, actually. Then we got a... Don't know who that is. Then we got him. We got this guy. We got Freaky Boo Boo. We got Chris Godwin. Uh, I don't know what this is, but I guess I got three players, so I mean, I guess that's cool. We got Kirk Cousins. We got Rashad Bateman. And then we got Justin Herbert. But with that said, though, now I think I am about to do laundry. So, yeah, I'm going to see you after that. I don't feel like there's a point of me fast-forwarding me doing that, so I'm just going to do this real quick. So, I'll see you guys after that. So, I just got everything off that table. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Got all my clothes put up. But basically, uh, tomorrow for sure, I'm going to have to clean up that mess. I'm probably put a lot of stuff away, give stuff away, and just kind of start moving stuff to my sister's room, I guess, because I need to basically have that room set up by next year. But with that said, though, I still have to clean out my sister's room because it's still a mess. And with that said, I might do some of that tomorrow. Who knows? We'll see. And yeah, basically, if you guys don't know, I'm turning this room into my office and I'm make my sister's room into my bedroom. But with that said, though, now I am going to, honestly, I don't know. I have to wait until my parents fall asleep till I wrap their big gifts because I still have to make them. So, yeah, um, we just got to go from there. For now, I'm just going to watch, you know, some KSI, drink some sparkling water, and wrap my cousin's gifts because, yeah, that's what we're going to do. So, yeah, with that said, I'll just see y'all when I see y'all. So, real quick, I am downstairs right now. The time is basically 11.30. You know what I'm saying? You can see it on that digital clock. And basically, I'm going to show you guys what I got for breakfast small. I had to get it from Target. I got bacon, eggs, and I got some, like, hash browns. Um, these aren't hash browns, they're potato tops, but I'm going to make them hash browns. And then we got uh, bagels over there. And we also have orange juice. And basically, yeah, um, I bought everything last second, so yeah, that's why I, it's being rushed. With that said, we're going into where the Christmas tree is at. Wow, look at that beautiful tree. And yes, these are all the gifts that my sister pre-wrapped and pre-gifted to us. Um, so yeah, I put them next to the tree because I didn't want the Dex, my dog Dexter to like eat it just in case. So I put the gifts on the box and basically, yeah. So that box right there is my dad's gift I have to build. Um, there's another gift under the Zoa energy drink that I have to build. And then there's something else by the tree that I have to build. It's on behind the tree next to Dex right now. But yeah, basically, 
this is the tree and huge shout out to my sister because she wrapped those gifts basically in like november before she left on her vacation so yeah shout out to my sister and i think majority of those are mine there's like one for my mom and dad one for dexter he got his christmas gift yeah dexter you got a christmas gift yeah that's the christmas presents with that said though stay tuned for that because i'm going to be opening up all of those presents after my parents leave tomorrow basically and that's going to be a whole segment in this video you know what i'm saying because there's probably gonna be different parts of this video and with that said this, the first part of the video is probably gonna be me wrapping gifts second part me cooking breakfast slash vlogging and then three is going to be me opening presents so yeah stay tuned for this video because this is probably gonna be a long long video with that said i'm just chilling waiting for my parents to go to sleep so i can build the gifts so yeah we're just gonna go from there and real quick i'm gonna get a quick snack as your boy is hungry. With that said though, right now, I am going to get a little snacky snack. And basically I am going to be getting a, one of these beef patties. These are pretty good, got them from Costco. So yeah, yeah, this is my, I guess, dinner. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this and talk to y'all later. I just put the beef patty in the microwave. And as I was grabbing it out, my mom yells, oh, you opening the Christmas gift? No. I'm not opening the Christmas trees. Am I a child? No, I'm out here vlogging and talking to myself. Um, don't know if that's better, but I mean, why I wore it like that, I mean, I don't know. We'll see. But basically, yeah, my mom be all in my business, bro. Living at home, bro, definitely has come with some challenges. Um, yeah, I miss my freedom, my space to myself. Um, I never really got space to myself because I've always had a roommate. So I guess I can't wait to live by myself. You know, I might be lonely. But I'm still Dexter and give him a friend and I won't be lonely. But yeah, it's just definitely a learning experience. But yeah, I'm going to eat the beef patty and go from there. These beef patties, are, I'm going to give these probably like an 8, 9 out of 10. These are pretty good. Um, I've air fried them before and I have microwaved them before. They're pretty good. I'll give them an 8, 9 out of 10. Um, so yeah, if you're ever in Costco and you see them, you should get them. But yeah, with that said, I will see y'all when I see y'all. But with that said, my mom is still up. So, yeah, I have to wait longer. So, I'm probably going to have to wait until maybe 1-ish, you know. So, yeah, we're just going to see what happens because I shouldn't have procrastinated. I shouldn't have made it, but I just wanted to make a surprise, but it is what it is. So, I'll see y'all when I see y'all. All right, so the time is almost 1. It's like 12.40. So, I decided to come down and just kind of get started and start creating the things I need to create. So, I guess basically. So, we're just going to basically start off with this coat rack yep we're gonna build this and just go from there so cue the time lapse hopefully i'm in the frame and hopefully i don't need any tools because i don't have anything um but yeah we're just going to create this and kind of go from there i have to somewhat be kind of quiet because my parents are upstairs sleeping so yeah there is that. So yeah, with that said, uh, let's start the time lapse. So yes, I'm done with the coat rack. That's the first thing that I finished. And yeah, let's just put that <laughs> right next to the tree, just like that. Yeah. Next up is going to be my mom's storage container thing that she wanted. So yeah. Hopefully this is as easy as the last one because the other one was fucking easy to mess up. So basically what happened is that my phone storage ran out and it kind of cut off mid of the time lapse. So instead of time lapsing, I'm just gonna have to just cut straight into what I've I'm done. But basically I just finished my mom's little storage container thing. That she wanted. This is what she wanted. But honestly, I feel like I need to grab them, like another one because this just looks too short. Like, like I don't know. This is like I don't know. It's kind of it's kind of short. It's like right here. It's like so. So it's like about by my ribs. You know what I'm saying? It kind of kind of short. But this is what my mom wanted. So basically, I'm gonna put this shit like low key, like right 
see you guys. I'm gonna put on the other side of the tree, but we will see. But yeah, I'm gonna build that. I'm not gonna do the time lapse because I don't have enough storage. So I'll basically see you guys when I'm done with that. All right, so the time is about 2.30 and I finished everything. It took me a while, but I did it. So with that said, we got the coat, coat hanger thingy right here. Over here, we got the new bench for storage. And then we got the extra storage containers. So yeah, I'm on the bench right now. Feels nice. So this isn't where we're going to put it, but yeah, that's basically where we have it for now. But yeah, that took me a while. With that said though, I only have to wrap a couple more gifts, but the thing that sucks is that I have to wake up in like six hours. So wish me luck. And yeah, so with that said, I'm gonna go wrap them real quick, go to sleep and I'll see you guys in the morning. So with that said, Merry Christmas to y'all. I hope you guys are gonna have a good Christmas. And yeah, and just happy holidays if you don't celebrate Christmas. And yeah, sorry if this video is all over the place, but I hope you guys are enjoying it. So yeah, with that said, Merry Christmas, good night, and I'll see y'all in the morning. Good morning, everyone. And yes, it's been some time. The time is about like 10 something, early-ish 10. And basically, um, I woke up at like 9-ish. My sister called me at 9, and then I made my parents breakfast. They opened up their gifts and all that fun stuff. And basically... To finish this video is going to be me opening my gifts and guessing what my sister got me for Christmas. But with that said though, when my sister called me, I didn't film that much because you know we were just spending time with the family and all that fun stuff. If my sister didn't call me, I probably would have filmed more with my family and so she could see it. But since she called me, she saw it live so I don't think I needed to film. You know what I'm saying? I hope that made sense. But with that said though, we are about to just open up my Christmas gifts and go from there. But my parents, I made the bacon. They loved it. Um, and yeah, the air fryer took a long time to make the hash brown. So yeah, I have a whole bunch of hash browns that I have by myself. With that said though, I'm probably going to open up my gifts and just go from there. So with that said, cue to that. Sorry for my repeating myself. Sorry for rambling. Yeah, let's just continue with the video. All right. So the previous clip that y'all just saw was honestly maybe about two hours ago. It's almost one right now and I am tired. I took a nap. Yeah, I'm tired. And basically what I was saying in that last clip is that I woke up at 9, my sister called me, and I didn't feel much because we were all in the living room or kitchen opening up the Christmas gifts that my sister got my parents, the gifts that I got my parents. Uh, she was on the phone as I was making breakfast for my parents. I only got to make bacon for them, and then they had to go to work. So, I mean, it's still something, but yeah. And then just with that said, I just didn't film it because my sister was on my phone. And if my sister didn't call, I would have filmed it. But since my sister did call, we didn't film it. So with that said, enough of me rambling. Let's just move on to what I got for Christmas. So in this segment of the video, I have seven gifts that my sister got for me, right? And with that said, we are going to be opening them and trying to guess what my sister got me because this is a test to see how well I know my sister. So yeah, this should be fun as you guys will get to see what I got for Christmas for my sister and then I get to see how well me and my sister are. So with that said, seven out of the gifts that she got me, I'm gonna guess majority of them are going to be Nike products, um, just because I know my sister, and we're just gonna see how that goes. So to start things off, we have this bag. It says, "Do not open until the something goes which is today." And basically, I think this is a pair of shoes. So yeah, let's just open up my gift. Let's see what we get. Oh, we got some pairs of shoes. Um, these are kind of some shoes I wanted. These are low-key kind of like dad shoes. You know I'm saying? Size 10 and a half. Yeah, you know, so we got the dad shoes. Y'all can't really see, but these are like the dad shoes. You know what I'm saying? I, I hope y'all can see them well, but this is kind of what they look like. They're like white, cream, grayish. Um, so yeah, this is kind of what they look like. Oh, shit, I just dropped it. Uh, but yeah. These are kind of cool, you know what I'm saying? We got the dad shoes. So, so far, I am one for one. And here's the next gift, And but basically, I'm going to be opening up the bag gifts first and then going from there. So this is the second bag, and I'm gonna guess this is a clothing item. And bam, it is a Nike hoodie. It's kind of cool, actually. Like, it's a brown Nike hoodie, and it has like the three Nike checks. We got orange. Uh, like a white cream brown right here and then we get a white one basically down here by the pockets and then right here by the hood we have a black one and then on the back we have two more 
So, yeah, this is kind of cool hoodie, actually. I actually kind of like it, you know what I'm saying? And plus, I need more hoodies for my collection, but I do need to clean out my closet soon. So, yeah, so this is going to replace one of the hoodies I already have. Next is probably the best wrapped gear that looks the best. Uh, to be honest, this one, I probably don't know, but I'm going to guess it's not a Nike clothing item. So, we're going to see. This one's a fancy one. we got to pull the bow. Whoa. And then undo that one. Let's see how this shit looks. This is definitely the most best wrap of the bags. So let's see what we get from this one. Ooh, we get. I, I was right. I got socks. We got more white socks. And then we got more black socks. So we got more socks. You can't ever go around with having more socks. And to be honest, I think I miscalculated my gifts. I think I only have a total of six gifts. I don't know why I said seven, but I only got six. Next is going to be this one, right? And basically, I already know what this one kind of is. And I just don't know which one it is. So basically, each year for the past like five years or maybe even longer, my sister has bought me a calendar. So this, I know this is a calendar. Just Is it a Falcons one? Because she's been switching up. The last one I got is that Braves one right there that you see in my background. Um, so yeah, I don't know if I'm going to get a Braves, Falcons, or Hawks. So let's see, but I know it's a calendar. So I, I hope it's a Falcons because I'm more of a Falcons fan. So that's the one I'm hoping to get. So we'll see. Moment of truth. It's a Falcons one. <laughs> it's a Falcons calendar. You know what I'm saying? Um, you can't go wrong with this. This is going to be what I have on my planning and all that stuff. That fun stuff. We got Cordero Patterson, Chris Lindstorm. I think that's Isaiah Oliver. He's not on the team no more. Um, we got Desmond Ritter, Richie Grant, Troy Anderson, Jake Matthews, Tyler Algier, AJ Terrell, uh, Kyle Pitts. Then we got Grady Jarrett, and then we're going to finish it off with my boy Drake London. So this is going to come in handy. This is a small one, and so it's not going to be always up like that because I don't keep that updated. I'm going to keep this one on my desk and write in it every day. So, yeah, this is going to hopefully – Help me keep me organized. The next one is going to be a shirt. I already know it's going to be a shirt. Um, yeah, so let's just. Okay, it's a brown shirt. I think this matches the hoodie. Bam. I don't know what it says on the front. It's just a plain uh, t-shirt. I think it just goes with the hoodie. So, yeah. Um, this one probably just goes with the hoodie, though. Not going to lie. But, yeah. So, so far, I am 5 for 5. I've gotten and guessed every single present basically right so yeah and now for the final one the last not least i'm gonna guess this is another hoodie or something um but yeah let's just see what we get Ooh, let's open this bad boy up it's a box this is some like nice wrapping paper this is like some expensive shit right here Now the moment of truth. We are going to be opening this up. Ah, it's it's a whole jumpsuit. It's a hoodie. It's like a red hoodie. Yeah. And then we got Nike sweats to go with it. Yeah. We got the whole fit. This is actually like a good fit for Christmas. Might have to wear that when I go to my aunt's house today. But yeah, that is basically going to conclude what I got for Christmas. I basically guessed every single one, right? So yeah, I can. it's safe to say I know my sister pretty well, which is a good thing, right? Um, but yeah, that's what I got for Christmas 2023. But with that said, though, I don't want to make this video much longer. So yeah, with that said, I don't really have much left to say. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you guys are having a good holidays. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. All that fun stuff. Happy holidays. So, with that said, I don't think I have anything else left to say. So, stay tuned for the last video of the year, which is coming out this Wednesday. And, yeah, with that being said, that'll be it from your boy for this year. And I'll see you guys in the next year. So, with all that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Subscribe, share, and your boy is out.